Gaby Cam y hoy voy a poner a prueba los conocimientos y las habilidades del de talento de Do Little porque vamos a jugar una especie de Jenga pero con animales. Are you ready, guys? Never. Never, never ready. ready. Okay. <laughs> you need to stack animals um, over the crocodile. There, are, there's a dice. Every time it's your turn, you have to toss a dice, and it says like you can toss one, uh, one animal, two animals. The real challenge here is that I'm going to be shooting questions for each one of you Can't while wait. you're doing this. What is it about this version of Doolittle that can be appealing for generations like yours that don't, didn't necessarily grow up? Um, I think this film is a lot about like Very acceptance. Oh, should I do it well? Yeah. <laughs> um, it's about acceptance, you know, like learning. Two animals. Two animals, okay. <laughs> <laughs> two animals, right. I'm going to do a snake. Let's hope this will uh, this one was about acceptance, I mean like stubbins and doodle, you know, um, and it's about learning to accept yourself as well as being able to accept others, which I think is really beautiful. Pretty good. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. What makes Doolittle a hero? Because you know a little bit about that. Well, I'd say he's an uh, anti-hero. You can give one of your animals to another player to stab. <laughs> is that all I have to do? Yeah. Um, Obviously, his his talent is that he has oh, unlocked you. the mysteries of interspecies dialogue. Okay. <gasps> oh, Did that you means. Did already knock something? Yeah, out? and Wait, that, I get the that means you get oh. that one. But you still need to, to to stack that one. If you could be Robert Downey Jr.'s apprentice as an actor, just like Tommy was in this film, what would be the first thing you would want him to teach you? It's really that's a good question. Um, yeah, it's really hard to start pinpoint. Uh, yeah. I know. A thing. Uh, Roll. <laughs> I don't know how are you gonna do this because that looks bad. Yeah. <laughs> You're giving all the animals. Oh my God, no! no. 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 Right. That was my fault. How that's do we beautiful. Get to do okay, yes. all right, Carmel, that's your turn. Okay. So did you finish your answer at all? No, I, honestly, <laughs> it is. Um, I think just learning how to be a pro, I guess. All right. I see that kind of experience. I W pro. <laughs> no, pro now. <laughs> what did you get? Two? Yep. Okay. This is not working uh, out. Uh, yeah, no. What do you mean? You know what? Just this. keep. Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Lucky seven. Let's go. Yeah. Ask okay, me a question. Then you, keep, you keep giving you. Your... No, that was a false roll. <laughs> okay, good. Ask me another question. Oh my god. <laughs> Actually, who loaded these dice? Huh? No one did. Hey, Jimmy the Greek. <laughs> do you, do you want to try again? Two. <laughs> oh, that's it. you're gonna Go you're you're gonna win. Um, if you could use the help of the animals to change anything that's bad in this world, what would you choose? <laughs> you're good at this. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, you kidding me? Okay. Hey, declare an early winner here. <laughs> okay. Imagine if, with all the environmental challenges that are happening in Brazil and Australia, imagine if these if these billions of animals. Oh could coordinate with local firefighters and stuff, uh, then we could help them get out of harm's way. That would be a big deal. That would be great, for sure. You, uh, which animal is he gonna yeah. stag? Which we need to choose. Oh. What are you doing? Uh, it's okay. I think it was two right. and it wasn't a like the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Well, I don't want this game to ever end. Okay. okay. It's, over. <laughs> it's, it's over. Okay, I think it is over. <laughs> <laughs> Harry, thank you so oh, much. Guys. No, thank I'm you. kidding. So I have to, um, I have a prize for the winner, oh. which is the one who has the least amount of, which obviously we know it's Robert. That's yeah. it. <laughs> so I got you this. Um, <gasps> this, is a, this is a Mexican kind of dog, uh, Charles Squintly. If you ever watch Coco, you can tell. Oh, what do you call it? Charles Squintly. Charles Squintly. Wait, I've heard of this. Yeah, it's like a hairless dog. So nice. this is handmade. I hope you enjoy it. Say it one more time. Xolo Squintle. Xolo Squintle. It's even harder for me, the Spanish speaker. It's, it's not easy at all. So what's the return policy on this? The, uh, what? I'm kidding. It's fantastic. I have nothing left. I will have it. You can't all be sleeping with it tonight. <laughs> I'll send you pictures. It'd be weird. Before, before I wrap up, I need to ask you one last question. Um, for you as being somehow newbies to this business and you being here for a long time, what would be that one thing that you really wish they would learn throughout their careers? I think that, I think they're learning it and have learned it, you know, we, we show up. It's fun when you're telling a fun story, right? We had a good time, but you know, there's a lot of technical stuff to do. And never forget, playing Jenga during press is the best part. Yeah. <laughs> you know? It was a mess, but we had fun. Yeah, yeah. it was really good. I'll yeah. send this, it'll be like, this will be like our Oscar. I'll send it around <laughs> and we'll, we'll keep yeah. it on our mantles or it'll prop up it? in the, the bathroom door, the loo as you call it, it'll be great. 
Thank Glad you very much. Glad I made much. a friend. Thank you. Thank you Glad so much for your time. You.